Hi, I'm Jilly Blankenship from Baby Sleep Made Simple. In this video, I'm going to explain how you can get your one-year-old toddler sleeping amazingly. A lot of parents think and hope that when their baby turns one, that their sleep problems will magically disappear, like that they'll outgrow them. Unfortunately, as a baby sleep consultant, I've not found this to be true. Your toddler's night wakings, his fighting bedtime or refusing to nap will all continue until you take active steps to teach him to sleep well. And at one year old, this is totally possible. Your toddler can be expected to sleep 10, 11, or 12 hours straight at night and nap for two to three hours every day. You just have to show him how. So in this video, that's what I'm going to help you do. My three big tips for getting your one-year-old sleeping well are to start a relaxing bedtime routine, teach your toddler to fall asleep on their own, and stick to a consistent daily schedule. Let's go over each of these now. Start a relaxing bedtime routine. Research shows that a consistent bedtime routine helps children fall asleep easier at bedtime, sleep longer stretches at night, and improves maternal mood. And because it's a relaxing for your baby and helps her sleep well, it's something that you want to do every day. You can keep up with your bedtime routine when your toddler is sick, when you're traveling, when she's teething, or even when she's going through a regression. It's a calming ritual that helps her body relax so she can welcome sleep. So you want to make sure you do it every day. You may be unintentionally causing your toddler to wake during the night by having the wrong bedtime routine. The activities that you do and the order in which you do them makes all the difference with whether your toddler is going to sleep through the night or not. In my free Exhausted Mom Survival Kit, I walk you through the steps of a bedtime routine that sets your toddler up to sleep amazingly at night. You can check out the link in my description below if you'd like to get your survival kit. Teach your toddler to fall asleep on their own. The way that your toddler falls asleep at bedtime is the way that he needs to fall back to sleep each time he wakes during the night. And waking or stirring during the night is completely normal. If you help your toddler fall asleep at bedtime by rocking or feeding him to sleep, then he's going to need your direct help each and every time he wakes during the night. And you know this because you may be up several times with your toddler right now, which is really exhausting. But when your toddler can go into his crib awake and settle himself to sleep on his own at bedtime, he'll be able to resettle himself each time he wakes during the night. And when you see this happen, it's pure magic. In 21 Days to Peace and Quiet, I help parents choose the right method for teaching their toddler to fall asleep on his own. I give parents a range of methods and then I help them pick the one that's best for their family. If you're interested in this, you can find the link in the description below. A consistent sleep schedule helps your one-year-old sleep well because her body clock is set to sleep at predictable times every day. When your little one's naps and bedtime happen at the same time every day, sleep will come easier for her, she'll fall asleep nice and easy, and sleep long stretches. Now sleep schedules don't have to be complicated. There's only three things to remember. The first thing is to wake your toddler up at the same time every morning. The second thing is to follow recommended awake times. If your toddler still naps twice a day, then follow awake times of three to four hours. If your toddler naps once a day, follow awake times of four and a half to five and a half hours. And lastly, make sure your toddler's bedtime doesn't vary by more than 20 minutes every night. That's it. My one-year-old sleep guide on my website, babysleepmadesimple.com, gives you advice for common sleep problems like my toddler's waking up at 5 a.m. every day, how can I transition to one nap a day, how can I switch my toddler from sleeping in the crib to sleeping in the toddler bed, my toddler's fighting bedtime or fighting naps, my toddler still wakes during the night, and the 18-month sleep regression. So if you'd like any advice on these common sleep struggles, make sure to check out the link for my one-year-old sleep guide in the description below. Remember, getting your one-year-old sleeping well is as easy as starting a relaxing bedtime routine, teaching your toddler to fall asleep on their own, and sticking to a consistent sleep schedule. I hope you liked this video. If you have any questions, you can ask me below. Make sure you hit subscribe. And also check out my toddler playlist here on my YouTube channel. It's got lots of videos about toddler sleep problems. Okay, that's it. I'll see you guys soon.